Hi everyone, I'm Eric Brooks with Alpine Electronics, and today I wanna to take an inside look at the Alpine R-Series subwoofers. So these are our newest generation of R-Series subs. So I wanna take you and show you a few features that are really Alpine-specific technologies and why these are so great for you and your vehicle. So let's check it out. So Alpine R-Series originated back in the early 2000s, and it was originally known as Alpine Type R. And Alpine Type R was known for being loud and fun, right? We used to say, for best results, play loud, right? And Alpine Type R gave us great output. And through the years, we developed significant features and technologies that went into our subwoofers and speakers that really gave them a great output and a really reliable bass performance in your vehicle. So I wanted to take just a few minutes and talk about some of those technologies that have passed on through the generations, but also talk about some new things that you'll find in this next generation of our series subwoofers. So the first thing I wanna talk about is uh, the fact that they come in different configurations, right? So we have 12 inch, we have 10 inch, and we have eight inch R, R series uh, subwoofers. And they come in dual four ohm or dual two ohm configurations, right? So you can match these things accordingly with whatever amplifier you have. So they work in the right uh, scenario for your system, right, in your vehicle. So first thing you'll notice is the kind of a redesign here. So you'll notice a new, um, a new dust cap, right? This new dust cap is a, a ceramic dust cap, which is very rigid, so it keeps uh, you know, everything in line as it moves in and out. There's no distortion, or it limits the distortion created when this thing's moving in and out. Another thing you'll notice is this, um, it's called an easy lock grill system. And this thing goes on kind of tight because we don't want it just falling off, right? So this ring covers the screws on the subwoofer itself but it also locks down a grill. So if you wanted to use a grill with this sub, you would take off that cover, put your grill down, lock the cover back on, and then you're ready to go, right? So now let's talk about some really cool things about this. So I get kind of pumped up on these subs, so I'm gonna come closer to you and really show them to you firsthand. So the Easy Lock grill system is still off, but I wanna show you here, this is called a hammer surround. It stands for high amplitude multi-roll. And what it does is it gives us the ability to, to allow this subwoofer to really move very far in and out, but it keeps great control over the subwoofer as it's doing it, meaning less distortion, more reliability, right? So that's one thing that's really cool. Inside the subwoofer, in here, you'll see this, this is called a, uh, a, a spider, and there's two of those. Again, this is the suspension, right? So like your car has shocks and springs, this is the suspension for the subwoofer. So it keeps everything in alignment as it moves in and out. Some other cool things you'll see here is you'll see these uh, push terminal uh, wire connections, right? So it's very easy to connect your uh, terminations here uh, to the subwoofer, giving you a reliable connection, right? So that's that. Uh, Another thing you'll see, and this is an Alpine patent, is this patented push-pull venting system, right? So this thing sucks air in, moves it over the voice coil, and then pushes it out through these holes in the basket. Again, all lending to reliable performance and playback in your car, right? But something you've probably never seen in Alpine before, but it's been there for a long, long time. This is called a compound radius pull piece. So if you stick your finger way in this pull piece in here, you'll feel it kind of cut out, right? And what that's called is compound radius pull piece. And the benefit of it is it uses this double stack magnet, right? And it allows the magnetic energy to flow very evenly across that. And, and that keeps great control over the voice coil as it moves in and out. Again, reliable, strong output. That's what it's all about. So those are just a few things on the R-Series subwoofers, right? Now, something else that's really cool that I like a lot are these jumpers, right? So these come in the box. So when you're wiring this thing up, we, we provide jumpers for you. So you can wire them in series or parallel and make them match your amp properly. So those are just a few things about the R-Series subs. Again, they come in 12s, 10s, and 8s right? And they come in raw drivers. So if you want to make your own enclosure, you can do that. No problem. Ported or sealed. They love it. Now, 
If you wanted a preloaded enclosure, we make those too. So we have halo enclosures that come in tens and twelves and they're linkable. So you can take one subwoofer enclosure, add it to another with a linking bracket, and now you have a two subwoofer system. We also have uh, a truck enclosure, right? That comes with eights. They're ported enclosures. They sound fantastic, right? So these are great things that we provide as preloaded enclosures for the R-Series line. So whether it's a raw driver or a preloaded enclosure, we have what you need to get great base in your vehicle. So there you have it, the next generation of R-Series subwoofers. Again, my name is Eric Brooks. Thanks for joining. We'll talk to you soon.